You want to sleep outside with us? You're sleeping outside? How, have you missed the memo? I was just telling you how hot it was. Where are you sleeping? In my bed. Well, you should sleep out there with Amos and I'll stay in here. Why are you sleeping outside with me? Why do you think? Bingo, five dollars for sissy. How are you let... That's like comfortable. Do you have like a match or something? No, there's a couch. <laughs> this is your big chance. You've been wanting to camp. <laughs> it's nine hundred. Is he asleep? No, he's not asleep. Do you think he's asleep? No, he's not doing well. I don't want to get COVID and I have to sleep with Amos. So, dun dun. Ooh, is Amos sleeping with mommy outside? Yeah. Are you camping? Oh, that's so fun. Well, you don't have your mask on. She has to wear a mask so she can go to the moon. Don't you want mommy to go to the moon? Yeah. Well, then she has to wear her mask. Why didn't I think of that? He's been yelling at me all day. <laughs> Look, the moon's up there. You see it? Oh, I see it. I don't see it. And mommy's gonna fly there when you're asleep. And take my mask off. She has to wear it until she gets to the moon. Yes? Mommy's not gonna wear her mask out here. <laughs> Take my yes, I'm going to take it off. Well, then no moon for mommy. Mommy's going to stay on the ground with Amos. Here. Where? Here. Take both, please. Take both, please, mask, and put over here. Well, I got my blankets out, and then he started taking them every time I put one down. <laughs> really? Sleep with no mask. Sleep with no mask. Okay. So you and I, you know, it's not so hot here. So there's that sewage plant right there, which actually kind of stinks. Do you see it? As long as... Where's the moon? In the sky. It's the what? Do you want your Do you want your water? No. It's hot out. We have to sleep here, Bobby. Where? Right here. You want me to sleep over there? Yeah. Okay, you're going to sleep here. Sleep here, Bobby. Okay, I sleep here. Okay, night, night. No. Let, let me go wash my hands. I'm helping. Yes, I'm helping you. Mommy's Help. Go We're There's sleeping outside both. because one of us has COVID and it's not me. Mm -hmm. And I'm trying not to get it. That is the goal, isn't it? Because some of us are going on a trip next week. Some of us are not. <laughs> Some of us don't know about the trip. Okay, mommy's gonna go. Go. What else do we need? You have all your blankies? Yes. Okay. Small you need your small blankie? Yes. Where is it? It's right inside. It's right inside? Get him. Get him? Yes. Get him. Get him. The small blankie. Are you sure? Sissy, have you seen small blankie? I spent my life looking for blankies because a couple years ago, we lost our blankie at Chapel Hill and people were really nice and started, we were trying to replace the blankie. So they started sending us blankies. So now we have like nine blankies and they're all boys and they all have names. This is what happens when you have COVID and you've set up camp in your mother's bedroom. So I was going to try to sleep in here with a fan by my face. But I decided. And I didn't want to. He is the cutest. Here's where it all happens. Kitty litter. Legos. This is my office. You have much patience. That's why it takes a lot.
Okay, hang on. Turn this on. Okay. Oh, there's a small blankie right there. Brian, you don't get sick. Does he feel sick? You know, he his he had a hundred point five temperature tonight, and he um, he felt bad this morning, and then he seemed better this afternoon. I'm gonna send my big three children home tomorrow. This is the third time um, he's had COVID. When do you go on your trip? I need to wash my hands. Tuesday. And the next question is going to be, are you going to still go on your trip? Well, I'm going to tell you. If I don't have COVID, the answer is yes, sir. Bobby. What? If I got COVID today, so if I woke up tomorrow with COVID, it was Friday. It'd be Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. I'd have to go on Wednesday, a day late. So we got a few days. I think we're good. And then if you got COVID, really, you could like miss a week of the trip, I guess. We're not gonna get COVID. Which one is the, I don't kill, don't kill, don't touch your face. Why just wash my hands? No, 100.5. Don't kill your husband medicine. Oh, that my friend Julianne told me about. That's called Zoloft. And I took Wellbutrin. Well, and we're probably gonna be 800 degrees because it's so freaking hot outside. Um, you, yes to a fan, airflow even outside. Well, it seems silly to put a fan outside, doesn't it? I guess the noise would be good, but I felt like I heard ocean. We're second row, but yeah, I don't, it's so hot out there. It's, speaking of Zoloft, I need to get my Zoloft. It's hot. <laughs> You're living the life. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna tell you something. Let me go to another bathroom, find my medicine. There are a lot worse things than this. And you know why mainly? Because Amos is vaccinated. Ah! The phone didn't break. He's vaccinated. And if there's one thing I've learned in life, you, what the hell am I gonna do about what's happening? I mean, literally, what am I gonna do about it? I think I've learned so much from being his mama that I just can't stress over shit that I have no control over. And I have no control over if I'm gonna get sick and be able to get on an airplane on Tuesday. I might know tomorrow, I might know the next day, I might know, look, I have light. Let there be light. Oh, there's a very large spider. But I don't have any freaking control over it. And neither do you. And if you're out there in the world somewhere and you think that you've got it all figured out, you don't. Because as soon as you go making some great big plan, you know what happens? It doesn't happen. Or maybe it does happen. But in my experience, like this smurf glass good things pop up when they're least expected just like a smurf glass that's nice um i can't read all these darn comments absolute best thinking ever your attitude is amazing um i what else are you supposed to do if i didn't have that attitude i would be freaking miserable Said you were entitled. Your books. Oh, I know. Somebody said I was entitled. I probably am entitled. I mean, I've got it pretty good. I've got an ice maker. I'm not in Ukraine or Russia or North Korea. I mean, what 
I can afford groceries, even though they're expensive. I have a great job. I have a daughter who sleeps in a bathing suit, which Sissy, please don't sleep in a bathing suit. It's smart. No, it's disgusting. It's a dry bathing suit. It's no, not like I'm it's it's in it. it's gross. It's not like I'm swimming in it. Well. Is somebody with Amos on the balcony? Uh, no. <clears throat> oh my God. I've got to drink all this water. That I'm one's not... living outside. I'll lock the door. <laughs> I'm going to. And I hope you have nightmares. <laughs> and the cat shats in your bed. I'm just gonna sleep in my nice, fluffy bed with my fan on and tiptoe by my side. I'm gonna turn the air conditioning off. Somebody just called you Gidget. <laughs> I mean, look. She's. What'd you do with the other cat? She went away. She's packing. She's getting out of here. Well, Where's my do you worry about him on the balcony outside? No, I absolutely do not worry about him on the balcony. Hi. Hi. Sleep with Bobby outside. Okay. Hey, night. Say night, night. Night, night. Night, night. Wish us luck. Okay, Mommy's going to plug her phone in and turn Bye. off the light. Yeah. Bye-bye. Night-night.